just in the last 20 minutes, we got an update on the overnight shootings in St. Louis. Four people are dead and one woman was shot in the stomach. Our Ryan Henson joins us live now from downtown outside of police headquarters. And Ryan, what can you tell us about any updates? Yeah, new updates that initial reports came in that woman who was shot in the stomach was rushed to the hospital. She's in stable condition this morning. We still haven't heard an update exactly a new update since overnight on her condition, but police give a, more details about some of the other investigations that happened overnight. We can go to North City and that ha this happened at about 915, about an hour after that one was shot in so and around the Tower Grove area. Three people gunned down, two men and a woman. That's in North City off the, in the Riverview area. That crime scene at the 5900 block of Lucille and police say this morning that they found firearms and suspected narcotics in there. Still no motive, no suspects, so still a lot more info we're looking from that investigation. Then a block away, about an hour later, a man found shot dead in the 5900 block of Harney of Harney. That's in North City as well. Police Chief John Hayden says they need more help from the community, not less. When I hear the word be from the police, I say, wow, people are, are if people are really considering uh, having less officers, imagine what 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 our situation will look at look like if we're trying to go to all of these violent crimes and balance this, the, the our response to civil unrest all at the same time with less people. I've never seen a greater demand on a St. Louis police police officer in 33 and a half years. For perspective, this time last year, we were sitting at 100 homicides. Not that that's a great number at all, but today we're at 130. I'm Ryan Henson reporting live from downtown. Back to you for now.